Hey everyone, it's Jasmine and I'm so happy you're here. Today we are at Wendy's to try some new items. So, first off, Dr. Pepper. Now Wendy's has one of those drink machines that you can like go into a drink and then pick a flavor. So I always get vanilla Dr. Pepper when I'm at Wendy's. Looks like there's some sort of sweet steaks. You could win college football experiences, hanging out with the guys on set, or even playing catch with a quarterback. Plus a chance to score 2024 season tickets. So, I don't really care about football, but there's tons of football stuff going on, I guess. She's spicy. Super busy. I'm going to take off my Apple Watch just so it doesn't keep lighting up at you guys. Okay. Let's see. Napkins. And a burger. Okay. So it's called the Loaded Nacho Burger. You can't even tell me that doesn't sound delicious. I have the description pulled up, so... Whoa. Something crunchy. <laughs> it's all in there. So it has tomato, lettuce, regular cheese slice, chipotle sauce, spicy chipotle sauce, queso, spicy corn-like strips, which must be these little crunchy things. And a jalapeno cheddar bun, which mine looks to have a normal bun. It was supposed to have a jalapeno cheddar bun, but I was really excited about that too. I don't think I got the bun, but that's a burger. The sun is really doing its thing right now. It is 11.30. Fork. We're gonna need that. Hold on. Okay. And peso fries is the other item. God, I can't get it open. <laughs> okay. This is what they look like. Not very much fries or queso, which is kind of stupid. They really gypped me, I think. But <laughs> I'm going to take a thumbnail quick and then we will start eating. Okay. Let's dig into this burger. So there's little like chunks and then there's regular strips too of crunchy stuff. Which I guess makes sense because it's called a loaded nacho burger. So having crispy little chips does give it the nacho effect. I cannot tell if I like it or not because I haven't really hit the queso plop. They plopped all the good stuff in the middle of the burger. Like, they didn't spread it out. So, now that I'm hitting the middle, everything's in there. Hmm. Hmm. I expected a lot more. I think I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10. 
It's not bad. I don't think I would get it again though. I really don't. Plus, I wish it was shredded lettuce. That's just me being picky, but I like shredded lettuce more than a giant slice. Anywho, we haven't seen each other in like a week. Work is insane. Like, really crazy. So, I'm going to have to get back on a filming and posting schedule. Because... The beginning of this week filming was just not happening so i also got to start filming more on the weekends anywho's we're gonna try these fries that is what they look like okay these are really really good That's the flavor I was expecting in this burger, but it just didn't come through in the burger. Like the spiciness in the queso. I think the cheddar jalapeno bun really would have added a lot. I don't know why I didn't get the correct bun. Maybe I'll have to come back and see if they and then I'll just like update you on Instagram or something because that jalapeno taste and the extra cheese yeah they knew that what they were doing with the jalapeno cheddar bun I just didn't get one <laughs> I'm gonna get the fries a nine out of ten they're really good I do have some naked fries, so I'm just trying to mix them up. <laughs> I hit season seven in Grey's Anatomy. The finale of season six had me in shambles. If you've watched it, you know. Absolute shambles. <laughs> Yeah, that show is just one crazy twist after another. When I'm like, oh, I can do the dishes. Nothing crazy is going to happen right now. Something crazy happens. <laughs> and then I'm like running over to the TV because I got to know what's happening. It's a whole event these fries this queso is delicious maybe they should have just gave me a little more queso on my burger something about the burger ain't quite right it's the bun it's definitely the bun they surely loaded me up with those crunchy things <laughs> i will say now that i'm part way through and like talking and stuff the crunchy pieces are starting to get soggy. So, do eat it right away if you want your crunchy pieces to be crunchy. <laughs> I am, pumpkin stuff came out at Starbucks this week and do not worry, that is going to be the next video. If there's any drinks that you really want me to try, let me know so that I make sure to get them because I'm just kind of going to randomly be choosing. I do prefer iced drinks over hot, so if you could recommend me iced ones. And now that Starbucks has released their fall menu, I've decided it's time to get out the de fall decor. So that is also what I'm gonna be doing this weekend. I'm 
this is gonna get posted Friday night. I think we're gonna go back to the Friday and Monday posting. Do you guys like those days? I used to always post every Friday and Monday. And then over the summer, I kind of just started randomly posting, but I think I'm gonna go back to Fridays and Mondays, so. at 6 30 p.m eastern standard time i really like that time slot it seems that a lot of you are on youtube at 6 30 and you can eat dinner with me it's just a nice slot it's hard because of all the different time zones i want to make sure that it's a good time for everyone so at 6 o'clock here over in California, it's 3 o'clock. So, yeah. I used to post at 10 a.m., but a lot of people were either at work or sleeping, and it just didn't really work out. So, now I post more towards dinner time. Also, some of you said... So my last video was a Hungry Howie's secret menu. And you were like, not so secret. They're advertising it as secret. That's the whole advertising. If you see a commercial for it or anything, Hungry Howie's is the one calling it a secret menu. And there's four different pizzas. I just only got one of them. One of them's literally a pepperoni pizza too. Doesn't really make sense. My shirt says, my kids have paws <laughs> and I love it. Zeus got a new sweater yesterday. Should I show you guys a picture of Zeus in a sweater? I'll pop it. That's Zeus. <laughs> he loves sweaters. Our other cat, you put a sweater on him and he flops over and acts like he don't know how to walk. So literally, I put his Halloween costume on, take a picture, take it off, and that's the only time I ever dress him. Zeus, on the other hand, loves it. And I figured this out the first year we had him because he didn't want his Halloween costume off. He was a pumpkin for the whole month. And so then I started buying him sweaters and now he has a whole basket of shirts, but it's kind of, I don't know, kind of like he's being hugged all the time or like he's more calm, snuggly, happy. He just loves having a sweater on, so. <laughs> That fry was not folding in half. I really thought it was going to. Oh, I'm getting my hair done Tuesday. Is it gonna be much different? Nah, not really, but I'm excited. <laughs> I'm just getting this pink taken out for the most part and then brightening up the blonde, that's all. And I've also been trying to grow out my hair for like years. And maybe I'll just get a couple inches chopped off like that. That's a good length. Probably do something right around there. And then these face framing pieces need to be brought back up to my chin. Just that. And just a little bit of maintenance to keep her looking nice. <laughs> Invest in like your hair and your makeup because it's one of the first things people notice about you. So 
those fries were really, really good. And if your location, I'm taking this lettuce out of here, has the cheddar jalapeno bun, probably knocks this up on the rating scale. Michigan weather really been playing with us. Last week, it was all like rainy and down in the 60s and now we're back up to the 70s in like the high 70s and muggy. And I'm just over it. I am ready for the cool fall weather. I want to wear sweatshirts. I want to get out my shoes that cover my feet. Pack up my sandals and put them away for the year. Yeah. If you live in Michigan or a state where it snows or all the different seasons, you know, I'm about to switch out my wardrobe because you have like a spring summer wardrobe and then your fall and winter clothes. All right, I am done with my meal. Overall, I enjoyed it. I definitely enjoyed the fries more, but I will be drinking the rest of this Dr. Pepper for sure. Let me know what your weekend plans are. I am decorating for fall and then on Sunday we are going to watch the Gran Turismo movie with friends and we play Gran Turismo the game all the time so I'm excited to watch the movie because we have like the whole steering wheel like simulator thing that plugs into the PS5 so we've been playing and I'm super excited to watch the movie. So if any of the rest of you watch that, let me know. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a big thumbs up down below. Hit the subscribe button if you would not mind. And also hit the notification bell right next to it so that you can be notified every time I post a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all on Monday. Bye guys.